Jamie formerly New Ring, SFL phone, is a SIP-compatible softphone and SIP-based instant messenger for Linux, Microsoft Windows, OS X, iOS and Android. Developed and maintained by the Canadian company Savoir Faire Linux, and with the help of a global community of users and contributors, Jamie positions itself as a potential free Skype replacement. Jamie is free and open source software released under the new general public license. In November 2016, it became part of the new project. Two account types are currently available, and many of each type can be configured concurrently. Both types offer similar features, including messaging, video, and audio. The account types are SIP and Ring. A SIP account enables the Jamie Softphone to connect to a standard SIP server and a Ring account can register or use an account set up on the decentralized Jamie network which requires no central server. By adopting distributed hash table technology as used, for instance, within the BitTorrent network, Jamie creates its own network over which it can distribute directory functions, authentication and encryption across all systems connected to it. Packages are available for all major Linux distributions including Debian, Fedora, and Ubuntu. Separate GNOME and KDE versions are available. Documentation is available on Ring's Tulip Wiki. As of the 18th of December 2018, Ring was renamed to Jamie. Topic: History. SFL Phone was one of the few soft phones under Linux to support Pulse Audio out of the box. The Ubuntu documentation recommended it for enterprise use because of features like conferencing and attended call transfer. In 2009, CIO magazine listed SFL Phone among the top five open source VoIP soft phones to watch. One step beyond SFL Phone, Ring retained SIP compatibility and support, while adding a new communication platform that does not require a centralized server to establish communication. Topic. Design Jamie is based on a MVC model, with a daemon the model, a client the view, communicating. The daemon handles all the processing including communication layer SIP, IAX, audio capture and playback, and so on. The client is a graphical user interface. Dbus can act as the controller enabling communication between the client and the daemon. <laughs> Features SIP compatible with open support Unlimited number of calls Instant messaging Searchable call history Call recording Attended call transfer Automatic call answering Call holding Audio and video calls with multi-party audio and experimentally video conferencing Multi-channel audio support experimental Streaming of video and audio files during a call TLS and SRTP support Multiple audio codecs supported, G711U, G711A, GSM, Speaks 8, 16, 32 kHz, Opus, G722 Silence detection supported with Speaks Multiple SIP account support, with per account stun support and SIP presence subscription DTMF support Automatic gain control Account assistant wizard Global keyboard shortcuts FLAC and Vorbis ringtone support Desktop notification, voicemail number, incoming call, information messages SIP re-invite Address book integration in GNOME and KDE Pulse audio support Jack audio connection kit support Locale settings, French, English, Russian, German, Chinese, Spanish, Italian, Vietnamese Automatic opening of incoming URL End-to-end -end encryption used for chat, video and voice Decentralized Topic. See also List of SIP software Comparison of instant messaging clients Comparison of VoIP software TOX protocol.